In what ratio must a grocer mix two varieties of pulses costing rupees 15 and rupees 20 per kg so as to get a mixture worth rupees 16.50? Well, that is 16 rupees and 50 paise. The cost price of the cheaper quantity is 15 and the dearer quantity is 20 and the mixture is 16 rupees and 50 paise. Just applying the allegation rule. You have to write the cheaper one in the left and the dearer one on the right, it is rupees 20 and the mean price is 16.50 in the middle. Now 20 minus 16.50 is 3.50 and 16.50 minus 15 is 1.50. You have to write it on the left and right respectively as shown here. Now, the required ratio on which we need to mix both the pulses is nothing but 3.5 is to 1.50, that is 7 is to 3. So, the grocer is mixing both the pulses in the ratio of 7 is to 3 and selling it for the price. Find the ratio in which rice at rupees 7 and 20 paise a kg be mixed with rice at 5.70 a kg. To produce a mixture worth 6.30 a kg. So it is same as the previous problem. Just applying the allegation rule, simplifying the problem, you will get the answer. Even you can do it by converting from rupees to paisa by using 570, 720, and 630. That could be easy for your uh, sake of simplification, and you can find the answer anything as you wish. Finally, you have to find the ratio. So, the required ratio is 90.90 is to 0 0.60. That is, again, you have to simplify that. 3 is to 2. He is mixing the two rices in the ratio of 3 is to 2. How many kgs of wheat costing rupees 8 per kg must be mixed with 36 kg of wheat costing rupees 5.40 per kg so that 20 percentage gain may be obtained by selling the mixture at rupees 7.20 per kg. So type 1 wheat cost price is what 8. Type 2 wheat cost price is what 5.40. So the selling price of the mixture, see they have given clearly in the problem the selling price of the mixture is 7.20, okay, not the cost price. And another thing you have to note in this allegation rule is you have to apply only the cost prices, not the, you should not mingle the cost price and the selling price. Now the cost price of the mixture is, you have to find, the formula for this is 100 by 100 plus gain percentage into selling price. You know the selling price that is being given in the problem. You know the gain percentage and you just need to simplify it to find the cost price of 1 kg of mixture. And another thing is you can apply only the unit quantity in the allegation rule. You can't apply for 5 members as a main price and 1 member as a uh, for a mixture price. Okay. You have to use for one members everything, one unit everywhere, okay? That is why we have find the cost price of one kg of the mixture, okay? Now by allegation rule, 5.40 is the type 2 wheat, which is a cheaper one, and type 1 is rupees 8, and middle is uh, the cost price of one kg of mixture. Now wheat to 2 is to wheat 1 is in the ratio 2 is to 0 0.6. To simplify what I am doing is 200 is to 60 I am taking. And it is 10 is to 3 finally. Now we know that second type of wheat has 36 kgs. Okay, I am mixing 36 kgs with some amount. I don't know what is that amount, that is x, okay, in the ratio 10 is to 3. So, it is very open here, that is 36 by x is equal to 10 by 3. They have given you the final ratio. We have to find only the, what is the kg. Now, it is 10.8 kg. We have found, this is the solution for this. 
the same problem how many kilograms of sugar costing rupees 9 per kg be mixed with 27 kg of sugar costing rupees 7 per kg so that the gain percentage may be 10 by selling the mixture at rupees 9 rupees and 24 paise per kg now they have given you what type 1 sugar is 9 rupees cost price and the cost price of type 2 sugar is 7 rupees and the selling price of the mixture is 9.24 and the gain percentage is 10. Now I have to find the cost price of the mixture because what I allegation rule I can apply only for the cost price. So I need to find the cost price that 2 for 1 kg of the mixture. So I am finding the cost price. Next what I have to do I have to apply the allegation rule. On type 1 and type 2 which is the least one or you can uh, simply write as type 1 type 2 in the mixture you can write it anywhere okay everything is cost price please check it before doing this problem because this problem has a twist of selling price okay now 8.40 minus 7 is what 1.40 and another is 0 0.60 so type 1 is to type 2 0.50 is to 0 0.60 that is 7 is to 3 and it is of the same like previous problem right so the x kg of sugar i am mixing it with 27 kg of sugar in the ratio 7 is to 3 it is very obvious that 7 is to 3 is equal to x is to 27 so x is equal to 63 kg this is the amount of sugar they are mixing this is three quantity problem last one was two quantity problem and this one is three quantity problem so three quantities say type 1 type 2 and type 3 are having a cost price of 126 rupees 135 rupees and x we don't know the price and they are mix, being mixed in the ratio of 1 is to 1 is to 2 so ratio they have given you cost price of two items they have given you and the cost price of the mixture they have given you. So again I repeat in the previous problem they didn't give you the cost price of the mixture they gave you the selling price of the mixture but in this problem they have clearly mentioned the cost price of the mixture. Now you can mix any of the two quantities and find the answer. So 1 and 2 are in the ratio of 1, 1 is to 1. It is very obviously shown here. So to find the average price for these two, what you have to do? The cost price of the mixer is 130.50. So type 1 and type 2. Now I will mix it with the type 3. So type 3 is what? The selling cost price I don't know. But the type 1 and type 2 average price I know. That is in the ratio 1 plus 1. So 2 is to to this one 3 is in the ratio 2 I am mixing 2 units of 3 with 2 units of 1 and 2 applying the allegation rule for these two 130.50 x and the mixture is 153 it will not change okay because we are mingling 1 2 and 3 now x minus 153 and 153 minus 130.50 is 22.50. Now the required ratio is x minus 153 is to 22.50. This is what equals to 1 is to 1 ratio. 2 is to 2 is what? 1 is to 1 ratio. Now on simplification you will get x as 175.50. So three types of pulses I am mixing in the ratio uh, cost price of this is 175.50 and I am mixing it in the ratio of 1 is to 1 is to 2. Now the shortcut for this method is 126 into or what ratio it is being mixed 1 plus 135 into what ratio it is being mixed 1 plus x I don't know what it is so 1 by 2 divided by 1 plus 1 plus 2 that is equal to mean price. Finally, on simplification, you will get the answer. Thank you.